What's up, Wayne Baron here with DarkEffects.net, and we are just plugging in our iPhone here. And one thing that annoys the heck out of me, and I'm pretty sure everybody else is, well, iTunes loads up without you wanting it to load up. Okay, it's fine in some cases, but in most it's not. It's really annoying. And so the easiest way to stop it is uh, you got to have the most recent version of the iOS installed on your iPhone which is iOS 6 and above which I've got iOS 7 you click over here and you go to iPhone and once you get here you scroll all the way down to the bottom and you choose automatically sync with when this phone is connected you uncheck that and then you choose apply now keep in mind that um, you need to make backups of your iPhone so at least once a week make a backup of your iPhone, overwrite the original backup of course, and uh, do this uh, uh, a lot. So also, if you're using Windows with your iPhone, which is what I do, then you can come over here and go inside of my computer, and then you can actually access your iPhone through here, which right now I don't have anything on my iPhone, so that's just... Uh, Let's actually take a picture so that we can actually get something on the iPhone so that we'll actually pick up on it and we're going to take a picture of the headstock of my son's Dean guitar and we're going to unplug the iPhone and then we're going to plug it back in and that way it will pick up on it and there you go it automatically load your iPhone as a device as long as there is something on the iPhone a picture a video whatever you're able to access it come over here you access your iPhone just like a USB drive and there's the headstock of my son's Dean guitar so uh, that is two good things that you can do with the iPhone with the new operating system is to disable the iTunes from loading with iOS 6 and above and I'm not really sure when or actually there is no win for the able to access it with Windows. Mac, I don't really think that you can actually access your files directly with a Mac computer. I think that uh, Apple made it to where you can't. Uh, but I could be wrong if I am. Please let me know in a message below. But uh, anyway, with Windows, you can access your files and you can basically do whatever you want to do with your files. All right, Wayne Barron here with DarkFakes.net. Remember to keep a backup of your iPhone. Y'all have a good one now. Bye bye.